Hello guys, this is Kids Code Campus and this is a tutorial on how to use Cratch. So let's get started. So you should have opened your computer and then you go to a browser, anyone. You go to Google and then you type in Scratch. So it should go on here and this is the website it's the first option so you click on it and this is scratch so if you see here this is options if you want to join or if you want to see examples but we're just going to try it out so if you don't want to account but you just want to try it then you should go for try it out So this is it, and these are all the tips if you want to create games or anything. So if you click on it, it gives you different things that you want to like program on Scratch. So let's go on to the scripts. So this is motion. So this is how you can move this object or character. So if you like click events and then one clicked, then you can move 10 steps and when you do it, it just moved a 10 steps. So there's loads of things, turn right 15 degrees, turn left 15 degrees and you can change it. You can, if you don't like it then you can just change on it 180 or 160, anything and you can change the and Y coordinates. So here it's 4, 9, but if you want to change it to 10, 10, then we click events and then like we click this and it just changes its coordinate. So let's move on to events. So this is the events. So this is how, like, if you click on a button or something you like to do, like the object to move or maybe even the background or anything. So if we do one press spacebar motion that we just did before, move 10 steps, it should move 10 steps when we click play then I'm pressing the space bar and it's moving we can change it to to um, maybe um, down arrow move 10 steps and it's I'm pressing the down arrow and it's moving 10 steps so there's a lot of th things like when when it's clicked, when the sprite is clicked, then it will move 10 steps. So I'm clicking it and it's moving. I'm not just dragging it, I'm just clicking on it. And there's when backdrop switches to backdrop one. That's the only one that we have right now. but. Um, you can add backdrops and new backdrops when we get to there. So this is loudness, but we don't have any music, only pop. And so that's it. So let's move on to the next one. The next one is looks. So if you want like your characters to say hello or something, so if I put one clicked, then looks, you can say hello for five seconds, let's say. So once you click on this, it says hello in the text box. Or to think, hmm. Mm, to think, um, mm, so like this. 
is thinking. It's got a text box, but it's not saying anything. It's thinking. And and for like you can change like not forever. You can do to think and for like only five seconds. So you stop, then play. Then it's saying um for five seconds. Then it's gone. So so. To switch costumes, and we'll get another character. So just wait. For this one, you can switch captures on the cat to you. I thought you can't, but you can. So, if you want to, like, one click switch costumes to costume 2, then if we play it, it's running. See? So it switched the classroom. So you can go like this and then run it again and it changes to the next costume. And so we don't have any backdrops and like this is it and if you want to like if we click on the backdrop we can set color or like well. So let's let's do the color. The color should affect too. So just hold on a sec. So here it is, change color effect by 25. So once I click on this, see it's changing colors, the backdrop. So let's move on to the next one. So the next one is control. So control is like wait one second. There's wait one second, repeat. 10 times forever if something then or if something then and then pre do else so I'm going to try repeat 10 times and motion move 10 steps so if I click on this then pray is moving 10 steps so repeat 10 times but if I want to make it slower, I can put one, wait one second, move 10 steps. Or if I want to, four. So, so if I play, it's moving 10 steps every four seconds. See, so let's make it a bit quicker. Two. So now if I play, it's going every two seconds. So that is repeat and forever, forever, it's like, it does it like every time and it will go off this page. So if I play. It's gone off the page and I have to drag it back and it keeps on going. So let's move on to the next one. So the next one is sound. So these are the sounds that this character, Sprite 1, can play. So if I press play sound meow, it plays the sound meow. If when I clicked it. So if I like play beat one for point two five it will play. So I can change the volume one hundred percent, set the tempo sixty and rest for point two five. 
So let's move on to the next one. The next thing is how to add a sprite and to delete sprites. So to delete this sprite, I just cut it off and it's now gone forever. So if I want to add one, I click on here. And there's many things. There's all animals. Before I should wait for it to load. I'll come back to you shortly after this. And so these are all the characters and that you want you can pick anyone. So I'm gonna pick a robot because I like robots. And here's the robot I can control it, I can do like move ten. I can control it the same as the cat. And if I want to I can add as many as I like. And like these were all and so I have a bridge, so just wait. So you can put as many as you want and this is I all I have like this and you can control them any way you like and to cut them you just get the scissors in the t at the top and then you just cut it them off like your cotton paper and so and so let's move on to the next one so to change the backdrop you go over to the far low left corner and you click on choose a backdrop from um library you also you can upload one if you want to so I'm gonna choose the the forest because it looks awesome. So if you double click it, it should come up in a minute. And so here it is, and you can see the backdrop. And so let's move on to the next one. The next one is costumes. So, if you can see, I changed my character, and like this is hip hop. And so, it has many costumes, as you can see. So, if you go to scripts, you can also do one spaces clicked, then you can looks. and then next costume so if I keep on hitting spacebar he is moving if you can see so let's move on to the next one next it's the sound here you can add music whatever you want like short Called clapping, anyone. But I've or it. This one came with the character. So, so if you go to scripts, sound, and then you play sound. So that celebration. So. So it's changing the sound. So that is it for the sound. So let's move on to the the next. Next, this is it, guys. Please like and subscribe to more videos. And so goodbye.